going guys welcome to another walk around video of this 2020 z900 in the candy plasma blue metallic matte fusion silver let's get into it and check it out so i got a request to do a video on the 2020 z900 se so special edition but come to find out the se is only available in malaysia and what the difference is is the se comes with a USB port charger, a radiator cover, uh, a single seat cover, which covers the back of the, the passenger uh, area, which is pretty popular overseas, dual engine sliders, dual fork sliders, and an extended windscreen and a tank pad. Guys, let's get into the meat and bones of this machine. This bike is an inline Ford 948cc. It has a slipper clutch, which is super great for a super naked, as Kawasaki is calling this bike. It has traction control, power modes, and with the new TFT dash that Kawasaki is putting on all of these machines that come with it, you actually get Bluetooth phone connectivity, which is great. You also get ABS on this bike as well, which is phenomenal. Great, great rider aids. This bike has a 41 millimeter inverted front fork and the ZX10, it comes with a 43 millimeter inverted fork obviously a completely different system can have that sporty feel to it it's going to be like it's riding on rails let me go ahead and turn on the lights for you guys these are actually the running lights i'm not going to start it up in the dealership but look at that it's like a praying mantis ready to pounce i think that is so wicked and especially with the white leds on this silver and blue it matches up super nice. While I've got this bike on, I'm gonna show you the 4.3 inch TFT dash. Again, this is the same dash that the ZX-10R has, that the Z650 has, and a bunch of other models from Kawasaki are beginning to roll out. This bike has a ton of customization within this screen. You've got three different ride modes. You can manage your power modes, your traction mode. You can manage your phone connectivity, and you have got a clean dash where you can see all the information that's required. Even in the daytime with this display, you can see it, it is bright and it looks amazing. One of the coolest features I believe on the Kawasaki Super Nakeds are these frames. They're a trellis frame and here on these new models, they've actually been painted to coincide with the current paint scheme that these motorcycles have. So with the walk around just about done on this plasma blue metallic matte fusion silver, let me go ahead and show you what else I got in store for you. I have the metallic graphite gray now up on the wheel chalk. I left the blue in the background just so you guys can have a little bit of a comparison. Uh, you know, we're a little tight on space, so I don't have the ability to put them side by side today. But this will give you the opportunity to look at both colors and see what you think. Let me know down in the comment section below which one is your favorite. I know the blue is a little radical from Kawasaki and it's something that we don't normally see from them other than the green, the black, the red. But I have to say I'm very impressed with that blue and I think what it is, the silver sets it off and makes it look super good. Quick specs on these bikes. It only has a seat height of 31 and a half inches and it only weighs 467 pounds. That is curb weight. That is a full tank of gas and everything mounted and hooked up. The last great selling point on this bike is the price tag. This bike comes in sub 10 grand. You're talking $9,000 for the non-ABS version and then 9,300 for the ABS version. All right, guys, that is a wrap on the 2020 Z900. I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave a like, comment down below, which is your favorite color scheme? Are you going with the notorious black and green or are you doing the out of this world blue and silver? Let me know which one's your favorite. I actually like this green one right here if I had to take either one of them home. Big thanks to Northeast Georgia Motorsports for letting me come out here and do the video on these bikes, move them around, check them out, get my hands on them, and you should do the same. I've left their information down in the description below. Come down, check them out, tell them I sent you, and get on one of these bikes today. It's like always, ride safe, have fun, and I will see you on the next one.